Hey guys, I'm going to show you how you put a new firmware on a Cyclo DS Evolution flash card. All you need is a DS Lite, a Cyclo DS Evolution, and a micro SD card. Now, you need to click this button that's on this video right now that's appearing. Click it and it will redirect you to the page of Cyclo DS to where you can download our latest firmware. Once you download that, it will be in a zip format. You want to open the zip format like this. And you should have a file in there called update.evo with evo. And you want to extract that to the micro SD card root. The, the root of the micro SD card which is basically you click the drive and that's it. You don't go into any folders. Just leave it there. Just extract it to it. Then once you have that done, you're going to put your micro SD card into your Cyclo DS, like so. Then you're going to start it. You should see, of course, Cyclo DS. Just going to start that. If you look at the top on the bottom touch screen, it'll say Cyclo DS Evolution Updater. It'll give you a warning here. This application will update your Cyclo DS Evolution firmware to version 2.2, which is the current firmware making this video. It says press A to continue. What you going to do? And of course, once you're done uh, doing that, it's going to be updating it. It says, do not turn off your DS. I would also recommend, before updating this, that you plug it into an AC power adapter, your charger cord. That way it don't die when updating. Right now I have it fully charged, so I'm not really worried about it. And then of course, once it's updated, it will have the newest firmware. It probably supports more game titles that could fix some problems. It, I don't know if it updates the cheap file or not. And boom, it's done. It says update complete. Press A to power off your Nintendo DS. And there you go. You got your card updated simple as that and, it, and updating your firmware could help out a lot of problems so before you start asking questions about things make sure that you have the latest firmware on your flash card that could make support a lot easier and it saves time to help others that are really in need when you could just update your firmware well thanks for watching